Hi everyone, I'm Elijah. Welcome to Music Greatness. For today's lesson, I'm going to break down Little Blue. It sounds just like this. Okay, for this part, I'm going to break down verse 1 and pre-chorus 1. We're playing in the key of E flat. And for the chords, we're going to start with E flat major. Playing E flat on the left with E flat and G, right hand. Then we're going to move up with E flat over G. G on the left, E flat and B flat. Moving up again with A flat major, A flat for the left, E flat and C for the right hand. And still going up, we have B flat major after that. For the left, I'm playing B flat, and for the right hand, I have D and B flat. And then we have C minor. And now I'm going to play four notes. Two on the left with C and G, and then two on the right with E flat and G. Moving up a fourth with F minor seven. That's F and C for the left, E flat and A flat for the right hand. So we have the root, the fifth, the seventh, and the minor third on top. And then the last chord we're going to use in the verse is F minor with B flat on the bass. So that's B flat and A flat on the left with C and F right hand. So as you can see here, we have F minor first inversion with B flat. Okay, let's take a look at the rhythm and the playing pattern. It goes like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, E and a four, E and a one. Two, three, E and a four, E and a one. Two, three, E and a four, E and a one. Two, three, E and a four, E and a one. Two. 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 2 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 2 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 2 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 E and a 2 E and a 3 E and a 4 E and a Okay, let's stop here. We're going to start before the first beat. We're going to play those three chords, E flat, E flat over G, moving up to A flat major. And like I said, we're playing it before the first beat. So we have E flat played on the A uh of the third beat. So we're going to count in 16th notes. 1 E and, 2 E and, 3 E and, 4 E and. So 3 E and, that's when I'm going to play E flat. And then on the E of the fourth beat, I'm going to play E flat over G. And on the A uh of the fourth, A flat over C. So before the first beat. 
three e and the four e and the one. Okay, so one e and two e and three e and the four e and the one. Two, three e and the four e and the one. Okay, after that we're going to repeat the same rhythmic, the same rhythmic pattern, but with different chords. Now I'm going to play that over A flat, B flat, and C minor. Three E and the four E and the one. Okay. After that, I'm going to continue, still using the same rhythmic pattern. But now I'm going to use my right hand to play G on the A uh of the third beat, and then B flat on the E of the fourth. And after that, I have F minor seven played on the A uh of the fourth beat. Three E and the four E and the. Three E and the four E and the. All right. After that, I'm going to play F minor over B flat on the third beat. So three E and the four E and the one, two. 3 E and a, 4 E and a. And then I'm going to finish playing E flat on the A uh of the fourth beat. 3 E and a, 4 E and a, 1. Okay, from the top. 1, 2, 3 E and a, 4 E and a, 1. 2, 3 E and a, 4 E and a, 1. 2, 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 2 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 Okay, coming up next, we're going to repeat pretty much what we had, but I'm going to sustain the first E flat. Okay, so we're playing E flat on the A uh of the fourth beat after playing F minor over B flat going to sustain that chord and then we're going to continue and play E flat over G on the E of the fourth and A flat on the A. So three E and a four E and a one. Two three E and a four E and a one. Just like this. Three E and a four E and a one. Two 3 E and a 4 E and a 1. So here we're not going to play anything on the A uh of the third beat. Simply sustain the E flat. Okay, so we're on A flat major. Then we're going to continue. Going to C minor. And again, F minor 7 to F minor over B flat, followed by this. Three, four, one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one. So here, I'm going to play this melody line on my left. That's F, G, B flat, C, D, a quick B flat down to E flat. And I'm going to start this melody line on the E of the first beat after playing. F minor over B flat. So three, four, one E and a, two E and a three. And as you can see, I'm playing the B flat on the A uh of the second beat and then E flat on the third beat. And directly after that, I'm going to continue with my regular chord progression with E flat on the A uh of the third. E flat over G on the E of the fourth, and then A flat on the A uh of the fourth. Just like this. So again, three, four, three, four E and a one, two, three E and a four E and a one, two, three E and a four E and a one, two, 3 E and a 4 E and a 1 2 3 4 
one e and two e and three e and four e and one just like this okay then from here we're going to continue with a flat b flat going to c minor then this f minor seven So we have our second melody line. And here we're going to use both hands to play this. So after playing F minor over B flat, I'm going to play E flat alone on my left on the R of the fourth beat. 3 E and 4 E and 1 E and 2 E and 3. So, I'm going to play A flat, G, E flat, B flat, and then A flat on my right hand. And I'm starting with my fourth finger, as you can see, then finger three, two, one, and then I'm going to switch over with my third finger on A flat. And directly after that, I'm playing F on my left. And then I'm going to replay a quick F moving up to G. And it starts again on the E of the first beat. One E and, two E and, three E and, four E and. One E and, two E and, three E and, four E and. And again, directly after that, we're going to resume our chord progression. So start with your right hand, finish with your left, and then continue with the chord progression, C minor, F minor 7, F minor over B flat, and then we're going to finish verse 1 playing this. So, now I'm going to extend and play E flat on beat 5, and then start this melody line on the E of beat 5. So for this measure, I'm going to count up to 6 beats. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and six okay so from the top three four one e and two e and three e and four e and one two three e and four e and one two three e and four e and one two three e and four e and five e and six e and one and directly after that, we're starting the first pre-chorus. So, 5 E and 6 E and... So, play E flat on beat 5, and then on the E of beat 5, start this melody line. B flat, G, E flat, C, B flat, A flat. I'm using my fourth finger, finger 3, two, one, and then four, back to three. Five E and six E and one. Okay, so I'm not going to play the last 16th notes. I'm going to sustain on A flat and then start the pre-chorus on C minor. Just like this. Okay, if you got everything, let's replay the entire verse. One, two, three, four. One, two, three E and four E and one. Two, three E and four E and one. Two, three E and four E and one. 
two, three, four e and a one, two, three e and a four e and a one, two, three e and a four e and a one, two, three e and a four e and a one, two, three e and a four e and a one e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a one, two. Three e and a four e and a one, two, three e and a four e and a one, two, three e and a four e and a one e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a one, two, three e and a four e and a one, two, three e and a four e and a one, two. Three e and a four e and a five e and a six e and a one. Perfect. We're now on to pre-chorus one, and for the chords, like I said, we're starting with C minor, with C G C on the left, E flat and G right hand. Then we have E flat over G. Playing octave G on the left, B flat, E flat, and G. Right hand. Then we're going to move up with A flat six. That's A flat, E flat, A flat for the left, C and F right hand. Then we're going to replay E flat over G with different, with a different voicing. So that's. G, E flat, and G for the left, and for the right hand, I'm playing B flat and E flat. Okay, then I'm going to go up with B flat minor seven. So we're going to play off key. B flat, F, A flat for the left, D flat, and A flat. Moving up to A flat over C. C and A flat, C E flat A flat, and then we're playing off key again with D flat sus two. That's D flat for the left, with A flat D flat and E flat for the right hand. Moving to the one chord E flat major, first inversion, E flat for the left, G B flat and E flat right hand. And then finally, we're playing this. That's A flat sus two over C. So for the left, I'm playing C, and right hand, I have A flat, B flat, and E flat. And that's all for the chords. Let's take a look at the rhythm and playing pattern. Two, three, four. One E and a two. Three e and a four, one e and a two, three e and a four, one e and a two, three e and a four. So I'm going to count in sixteenth notes once again. One e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a, and I'm simply going to arpeggiate each chord. So I'm going to play an arpeggio on C minor, C G C E flat G, in sixteenth notes. So one e and a, Two e and a, and then I'm going to do the same for the next chord. One e and a, two e and a, three e and a, four e and a. So e flat over G. Three e and a, four e and a, a flat six. One e and a, two e and a, and then the second voicing for e flat over G. Three e and a, four e. After that, we have B flat minor seven, one E and two E and moving to A flat over C, three E and four E and. So here it is, one E and two E and three E and four E and one E and two E and three E and four E and one E and two E and three. 
so simply arpeggiate one note after the next based on the chords I just played. Alright, then to finish the pre-covers we have this. So I'm going to play D flat sus 2 moving to E flat, back to D flat sus 2 and then A flat sus 2 over C. So D flat, E flat, D flat, A flat over C. Okay? And here's the rhythm. So one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and. So play the full chord on the first beat for D flat sus two, and then you're going to replay the notes on your right hand on the A uh of the first beat. One E and a two E and. And then on the end of the second beat, play the next chord. And here, that's E flat major. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and. And then you're going to replay twice the notes on your right hand, both on the E and the end of the third beat. Three E and. Three E and a four E and. And then after that, on the fourth beat, you're going to play the note on the left and then replay the note on your right hand on the E of the fourth. So, one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a three E and a four E and a three E and a four E and a okay. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a. And then you're going to repeat the same rhythmic pattern now playing with D flat sus two followed by A flat sus two over C. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one. And then we're going to start chorus one with E flat played on the left down here. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one. Just like that. Let's replay the entire pre chorus. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One E and a two, three E and a four E and a one E and a two, three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one. Perfect. We can now recap and replay the verse and pre chorus at full speed. Here it is. And that's all for this first part. For the rest of the song, please head over to musicgreatness.com. As always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.